is me. This is first of all before we get to the race. This is me and uh, Joshua in a race we did. Um, actually got second him in, in a race we did in Kenya. But yeah, that was a while ago. This let's get to the five thousand meter record. This is look at these masks on. Uh, everyone's wearing the masks. There's social distancing. I don't see social distancing in the race, so I don't see guys wearing masks. So I'm a bit concerned. That we could have a bit of a cluster. There could be a 5,000 meter world record COVID cluster um, in this situation here. So I don't think we've got, you know, we've got guys running the alpha flies. So I think we've got issues here with the uh, social distancing rules being breached. This is a breach of COVID. Let's get into it. This this is a world record we're about to see here. I'm tying up on the line, getting towy. And they're in track spikes. And uh, just trying with the alpha flies. Look how skinny these guys are. These guys are skinny. All right. So we're going for. The world record here today. This is a 5,000 minutes. Let's just move that camera over there. And look at this. This is already getting hot pace. We can tell it's a hot pace because they're all pretty much single form. And there's guys at the back getting dropped already. Look at look at look look at this. And there seems to be a heavy Nike uh, presence here. I guess I think maybe it's a Nike sponsored event, but we see Nike. One guy's wearing arm warmers. Arm warmers. Arm warmers in a 5k. It must be pretty cold if you need arm warmers. I'm not sure about that. I'm going to be going with staying as cool as possible. I could be wrong, but this is filmed in Monaco, which is in summertime. So I'm not sure the arm warmers are going to be a good idea in Monaco. So you can sort of see here, we've got a bit of an Oreo situation here. We've got the, the chocolate and the vanilla. They have a mix. We all like that. And I've got the headbands. People are wearing headbands. Headbands in a 5,000 meter. Keep that warp thin. Keep that perceived exertion high, higher than it has to be. And uh, we're going to see Joshua breaking three eventually. Uh, so this is here we, we have the top six runners here. You can see that. Look at that gap. We're one minute fifteen in, and there's already the A group and the B group. Wow, it's split up on in the first minute. Oh, these guys are striding, striding at the front. Look how look at the exertion our front runners got here. And they are sprinting it, all right? So faces relaxed. This is the B group. There's A's and B's. And the B group is content just to get dragged around. And this this is the six guys here really setting the pace. The heels up. And you can just sort of see the the guy in third. He looks like he's about to pop. He's still staying relaxed. But you can tell his perceived rate of exertion is quite high. And we see in this front group, the A group, no one's wearing headbands no one's wearing arm warmers. At the back here, people are wearing sunnies. Now. <laughs> like, you don't need sunnies in a 5,000. You don't need headbands and arm warmers in a 5,000. And that's why in the B group. And now, these guys are a lot faster than me. But I'm just saying, from a coach perspective, I would not be letting my athletes run in a headband and arm warmers and sunglasses. It's hot out there, all right? So look at this fr front runner here. Maybe he's just pacing. I'm not sure what's going on. But I've got a guy here. Was, he's, was it say Russia? He's from Russia on the front, maybe? And he is a um, he is taking over the lead. What's what, what, what's going on there? He was a pacer. Is he a pacer or did he just run out of carbs? I think maybe he's a pacer. Maybe there's paces going on here. Maybe that's what the blue the blue singlets are. I don't even know, but I don't think I don't think he was a. Pa I'm not sure what's going on. Someone fill me in the gaps here. No, there's paces going on here. Okay, so there is paces going on. Well, <laughs> people are like that's pretty full on when the paces are blowing up. Holy mamma mia. Mamma mia. There's paces in here. What's this guy at the back doing here? Is, is he dropped his walker or something? What's going on here? Is this a pacer as well in the blue short? Maybe this is what's going on here. The actual legit races in the black. I don't even know what's going on. The differences here between the athleticism is gaping. Is We've got a Mandingo gap already and we're five minutes in. This is like this is like me at Park Run. All right? With the low carbers. This is insane. All right, this is insane, the gaps here. So I do think this is a pace runner in the blue. I'm going to make that assumption. He's absolutely on the limit. He's absolutely on the limit, as I predicted earlier on. This this guy in front in the blue is absolutely on the, the limit. Absolutely on the limit. Um, good technique, but you can just tell he's just absolutely on the limit. And these African guys, well, there we go, boom, pop. Wow, that is my friends. That is that is the difference here. Now people said, Harley, do you think this this time, this world record we're about to see, do you think it's natty, naturale? Is there any elephant EPO? I, I would say this is clean. This is definitely clean, and I'll let you know why. 
One, he's got his mouth closed. All right, so he's not. He's just having a bit of a spit. He's got a little bit of bubble gum on my teeth. I'm just gonna spit out of him. Still doing a bit of a run. They're just going out for this is a training session, right? And you can tell on their face they're very relaxed. So, I would say, um, elephant EPO is currently only um, prescribed to elephants in the circus, all right? And the circus of the Diamond League is is uh, out of that jurisdiction. So I would say this is definitely clean and clean sportsmanship, clean natty stuff. These guys are, you know, there's two of them in the race now. And, and the rest were just sort of in, invitational runners. Let's click off this advert here. Drag, Dragon Medical. What <laughs> what Dragon Medical gives you? All right, so I don't think that our friend here, Josh, was on any, any Drag, Dragon Medical uh, product. There seems to be a gap there. Maybe someone dropped a watch there. Um, maybe he's just checking, te- checking his te- text messages and just dropped dropped off dropped off the heels a little bit there. But there seems to be a gap there already. So we're 8 minutes 40 in. We've sort of sped it up there. How long does this video go for? All right, so we're 12 in. Um, and look at that strike. Look at that. He's just... His eyes. See, I think I think they made a timing error with this one. I don't think this is actually a legit world record because look how relaxed he is. You know, I think what happened is they they were going to do this race in Switzerland, but they missed the uh, the timing schedule. And so when you do a world championships in Switzerland, the, the climbing is a lot better. They must have they have to because look how relaxed he looks. He's not even straining. His mouth's almost closed. He's just looking down. Looking for anyone's dropped a garment or something like that. Maybe he's just doing laps. Like someone's dropped a headband around here. Someone dropped some sunnies in this last lap. I'll go pick him up for him. So he's basically doing a cool down lap. His buddy behind, what's his name? Kimeli. He's spitting. He's spitting on the track. This guy here, he's got his head down. He's spitting as well. So they're spitting beans. They're chewing edamame beans or something. Spitting out the husks. Good for vitamin B6. Niacin. All right? You want that nice and flush. In the hot weather, so he just yeah, just he's just striding it around. Look at look how relaxed they're running, man. <laughs> he's running for the bus, you know. He's running for the bus. It's it's very casual, <laughs> casual technique. Look at that face. This isn't the face of a world record. This is definitely trolling here. They're definitely trolling. This is no way near world record pace. Because look at the face. That ain't the world record race face pace. Right? That's not the world record pace race face either and these guys behind here these these are the the arm warmers and the headband guys i'm not i think this is just a nike a nike advert something going on here i'm not sure what's going on there there's maybe it's been unorganized maybe the paces are like we're going to pace you in the last lap i'm not sure what's going on here this seems to be i don't know what's going on please someone fill me in here this is look at this how relaxed his face is okay he's like doing 400 meter repeats times 12 this is no big deal here. This is definitely natural, right? Uh, we we do know that during COVID, testing procedures have gone up. You know, they're doing a lot more tests during COVID. They're doing swabs. They're checking people for COVID nineteen or any Edgar res- any Edgar nineteen residues. So it's it definitely looks like a natty time. Um, it looks pretty good. So, look, look, relax, relax now. This is I think this is a big blunder. This is gonna they're gonna leak any day. World Diamond League timing error. This is going to get leaked any day now. Look at his, his spitting still. His face isn't even open. His mouth is like he's almost trying to. He's spitting so much. He's got edamame edamame beans in his in his hand. He's just spitting the husks. Like, do you, have, do you do you ever do that when you when you go for a PR? You keep spitting a lot. Yeah, I do that all the time. You know, mouth half closed, doing a PR today. No, no strain on the face, just cruising, you know, spitting a bit. It's like it's from Louisiana, bubblegum shrimp. And this guy here wonders. He's wandering around. See, everyone's here. There's no, not much social isolation going on there. There's people sitting next to each other. That's a bit concerning. Wonders is wandering around, wondering when is the race even going to start, what's even going on. I think the timing's just out here. There's no way that this guy has lapped a European 10,000 meter champion. There must be something going on here. Maybe this is in relation to Black Lives Matter protests. They've just given this guy the win or whatever, or they cut out a few laps and then cut the screen. Because look at his face. Uh, so the world record is uh, 12.47, and he's... No, he hasn't done that. No, no, he didn't just run 12.35 and smile across... <laughs> no, this, this is a timing error. <laughs> this is a timing error. This is... is this is, is this the face... Is this the perceived exertion of someone who's just run a 12, 37, 5K? 
they've done a timing error, all right? He's jumping up and down and like saying, hey, thanks, guys. There's no exhaustion. There's no grimacing. He's like, yeah, well, I think I just broke the world record that was set by uh, my famous natty friend, Bekele. Look at that. Bit of sweat there. Not hardly even breathing. He's like, yeah. Sticking the tongue out a little bit. Oh, yeah. Well, maybe I'll start breathing. No, 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 he's back to normal breath. Oh, yeah. No, he's spit again. His chest is hardly even heaving. His belly, his diaphragm's hardly even moving. He's just like, oh, yeah. Go sit down for a little bit. Pretend I'm tired. No, I'm not. Got my mouth half shut. No worries. Taking a photo. Oh, high five. I'm lucid. 12.37. No worries there, mate. No worries. 12.35 even. Wow. 12.35. And K-pop did a 13.11. Camille, 12.51. Foppin was foppin' off the back at 13.13. So almost 38 seconds slower. Almost 38 seconds slower. All right. So, yeah. This definitely is natural time. They just they just stuff up the timing chips. They stuff up the timing chips. Look at that. Look how relaxed they look. Look how relaxed. So this is where they're breaking away or whatever. I think this is where someone dropped some edamame beans and Kameli stopped to pick some up. Because there's no way that was a 12.35 based on that facial effort, was it? You know, There's no way that was the go. They, they, just, they definitely stuff up the time. Omega watches or whatever. They should have they hired Seiko or Rolex or Tag Heuer. Get the tag on the stack. 12.35. Thanks for coming, Mamma Mia. Wow. And look at that. Not even not even grimacing. Just calm and relaxed. Picking up pace. Picking up pace for the last bit. Picking up the pace for the last bit. Look at that. Just coming across the line. Just steady. Just like he's doing a 1K repeat. Yeah, not, the face is hardly even sweat. A little bit of little bit of sweat there on the neck. Not too much. A bit on the brow. This guy's sweating more in the in the stands here on his little mask. Wow. So there's not that much sweat going on there, really, is there? You know? Not drenched. The, the singlet's relatively dry. Compared to that guy there, his singlet is drenched. And uh, our uh, our champion here is uh, not even drenched in sweat. And he's run a 12.35. Definitely natural. Nothing to see here. I think they just... Look at that. Oh, it's a little bit sweaty in the singlet, but... Not as sweet as you, as you expected. Anyway, that's the deal. That is the video. Full natty bra. Nothing to see here.